What's up my dogs? It's your dog, M Dog, and welcome to a whole different kind of video. So today I got the skins, I got the bowls, I got the milk. I think you can guess what I'm doing. I'm doing a cereal food review. <laughs> So let's show. Cereal one. <laughs> Nutter butter cereal. Cereal number two. Honey butter cereal. And cereal number three. Sour Patch Kids cereal. So we're gonna save the worst for last. So I'm thinking that this will be the worst. This might be a little too sweet, and this will taste like um, Reese Puffs. So I'm gonna do this one first because I think it might be good. So let's go. This honestly smells bad. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, come! On. Look at all like the sugar on it. I don't know if that's supposed to be like peanut butter. That's a lot. Okay. So, first off, I'm gonna try it dry. So let's see how it tastes dry. That tastes exactly like a Nutter Butter. That's almost spot on with the Nutter Butter. So now, it's time for the best. <laughs> what you've been waiting for. The reaction to Nutter Butter cereal. Let me get it in the milk. It's not bad. It's not bad. It almost tastes exactly like a Nutter Butter. Just, of course, crunchier. It's not bad. I wouldn't say it. Amazing. Favorite cereal of all time. It's not bad, though. Got it. Man. I'll give this one a 5 out of 10 on the cereal scale. Halfway. It's not amazing. It's not horrible. It's just right. So yeah. On to the next one. It's good. Honey bun. So, like we did last time, let's try it dry. I thought it was gonna taste like a honey nut Cheerio. Once you start chewing it up, it does taste like a honey nut Cheerio. But at first, like the first little bite, it doesn't taste like one at all. You know? So now. in there. Are you ready for this, my dogs? Three, two, one. I, I thought it was going to be super sweet, but really it's not. I do like the Nutter Butter more than this still, I'm not gonna lie, but this is still, mm. I'm actually gonna change the Nutter Butter to a six out of 10. 
And then this one, the 5 out of 10. It's not bad. But. Like, I thought it was going to be super sweet. And it is. But after you eat it, it loses all its sweetness. Like, right as it touches your tongue. But. 5 out of 10. Pretty good. Probably wouldn't buy again. But yeah. So, 5 out of 10. Last one. Sour Patch Kids. It smells sour. It smells sour. Oh my gosh. It looks like Sour Patch Kids. I can already taste that it's going to be sour. But sour in milk? Like, that's what, um, um, out of thingy, that's when, when milk is past its expiration date. That's sour milk, but, all right, we have to try it out. This is the lemon one, I think. Let's try the green one. Blue. They're sour. I don't know what to expect here, my dog. Three, two, one. Let me try this one more time. Okay, what is just the milk? I wonder. The thing is, I'm giving this. Wait. not great it's okay it's not great this one not great but this the sour patch community did something game changing when it comes to cereal they changed the cereal we know and love i mean for once they did it good. Who would think sour and milk would go good together? I would. I didn't think it would actually. But once I took a bite, it's like something you've never had. Eight out of ten. Chicken. Eight out of ten. I like it. The next big cereal. If they ended up making spicy cereal, I'm all for that. I'm all for that. Sour community, Sour Patch community, great job. You guys did something. You made something beautiful. You made, you made beauty in a box with little guys. It was amazing. It was so amazing, my dogs. It's good. Get yourself a box of this. You want a bite? Have some.
10 out of 10. So, as you can see. Peace out.